Brian Delaney from TheCelebrityMaker.com. And today I have some questions for IFBB Pro Seth Ferrosi from Isolator Fitness. So Seth, will the Isolator make my secondary muscle groups weaker? Secondary muscle groups meaning like your biceps, triceps, forearms, hands, that type of thing. Right. Um, yes and no. It, it's on how you look at it. Whenever you're trying to work, say, your, your shoulders, whenever you pick up the weight, you're in your hands, and then you start doing sorry, shoulder presses, you're using your triceps to push the weight up as well as your shoulders. Well, imagine taking your triceps out of the game and actually just pressing with your shoulders using the isolator. Now you actually have more time for your triceps to recover as well as more time to actually work on them, say, on another day. So it's going to make them weaker because you're not going to use them as much, but then in turn it doesn't because you're actually going to take more time to work on your triceps and allow proper recovery because you either pair shoulders with triceps or far enough apart so that, like, you don't train your, your shoulders and say, oh, my triceps are too sore to do, to do shoulders or chest. Now you can actually allow proper recovery time and actually work the muscle group the way it's intended to be worked and allow proper recovery. Great. Thanks, Seth. Now here's what we want you to do next. Uh, you can check us out at www.isolatorfitness.com. You can go on to our fan page on Facebook, and you'll find us under Isolator Fitness there. You can check us out on our YouTube with all the variety of the videos that we have uh, under the YouTube channel Isolator Fitness, or you can give us a call at 610-575-0325.